13-year-old Michael Balzi Rodriguez was an energetic 13-year-old who loved football, pizza, and pranks. He died in an accidental shooting two years ago, but through organ donation, he helped five other people live. He was just full of life, you know, full of life. And now Michael is being honored in a big way on a big stage. A floral portrait of the teenager will be on a float in the Rose Parade, an event that will be seen by millions around the world on New Year's Day. The theme for the 2020 Donate Life float is light in the darkness. Today, his mother put the final touches on his florograph as family, friends, police, and first responders watched. I'm sad, I'm happy, I'm excited, I'm nervous, oh, lots of emotions today. I'm blessed to be able to have his his kidney. Alex Herrera was on daily dialysis for five years. I didn't have energy for anything. Um, just drained, felt sick, tired. He says with Michael's kidney, he is now able to work and have a family. It helped me a lot. I mean, it's it's a blessing. It's very thankful and uh, my life changed. Donor Network says there are more than 10,000 people in Northern California alone who need organ donations. They hope the example set by Michael's family will inspire others. And as for Alex, he says Michael's family is now his family and considers Michael's mom his child's grandmother. She kind of feels like it's part of her son also since I have his kidney. And uh, I send her pictures. Get, and she sends gifts to the baby. And Michael's own brother named his baby Michelle after him. Organ donation, a life-changing and life-saving gift. In Stockton, Melinda Meza, KCRA 3 News.